Meeting to order, ladies and gentlemen, commissioners and staff, welcome to the February 24th, 2014 public hearing meeting of the Greater Miles Planning Commission. I now call this meeting to order. As most of you are aware, the Planning Commission serves as an advisory body to the local member governments regarding land use requests. The determinations made here tonight will be forwarded to the applicable local governments as recommendations. We are a recommending body only. Final determinations regarding this tonight's request will be made by the appropriate local governments at the respective meeting. Even if the planning commission recommends denial or tabling of an item, it will still go to the local government for final decision. All interested <coughs> persons should attend the local government public hearing regarding these requests. All of the cases will be reviewed tonight are listed on the agenda which is available on the podium located at the back of the room where you enter. If you did not pick up a copy when you entered, you may do so now. Also available on the podium are handouts which outline the, group, the ground rules under which this meeting will be conducted. The handouts also include standards for conducting public hearing. During the meeting, I will call each request in the order that they appear on the agenda Staff will then present their report regarding the request and give their recommendation. The commissioners may have this discussion with staff at that time. I would next call for those wishing to speak in favor of the request and then those who wishing to speak and speak to against the request. If you wish to speak in regards to the request, please come forward at the appropriate time, state your name and your address, and then give your presentation. Fairness and equity to both sides is our goal. State law requires that we allow 10 minutes for, to each side of the issue. In the interest of time, we ask that you keep your comments brief so that all who wish to speak may have time to be heard. We also ask if that information given by the prior speaker not be repeated. If you choose to speak regarding an application, please direct all comments to the Planning Commission body only. Do not correct, do not direct comments to the staff, applicants, or to those in the audience. Do not turn to the audience or solicit debate from others. Please keep all comments proper, polite, and to the point. Once public, public participation is closed, all further discussion of an application is reserved to the planning commission. The handouts previously mentioned are included a copy of the standards for exercise, exercise of zoning powers which are guidelines we use for determining whether or not a request is consistent with the comprehensive plan. These standards are significant factors we use in making our decisions and final recommendations. The handouts are included a copy of Georgia's Conflict of Interest in Zoning Law Guidelines. All planning commission members will be asked to excuse themselves from acting on a matter in which they may have a conflict by stating so at the beginning of the case. Final actions on tonight's application will be held as follows. We have our Lowndes County, Tuesday, 11 of March at 5.30 at Lowndes County Judicial Administrative Complex. We have our city cases on the 6th of March, Thursday at 5.30 at Beth Austin City Hall. We appreciate your, your attention to these housekeeping issues and again, welcome you to our meeting. Now I would like Commissioner McLennan to lead us in the invocation followed by the police sir. Heavenly Father, it's once more and again that we've gathered 
to do business for the county and the city. Lord, let this meeting go in a way that you would be proud, that we will respect each other, that we, in respecting each other, we will have honored you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America.